get any of that, Megan? The tangerine none of fan? That's, no, none of that. But I did try a lot of the other things yeah. that were over there. <laughs> and they were all really good. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for the fair next year. All right, let's show you Coronado this morning. It's dark, it's early, but it's still lit up and shining brightly over the Hotel Dell. Temperatures are starting off on a pretty mild note in the 60s and 50s, and there is a little fog near Fallbrook. Visibility right now about four tenths of a mile, but I've seen it between three tenths and about eight tenths of a mile so far this morning. So just leave to have it for travel if you're traveling through Fall, Fallbrook or Bonzel. Some of those areas may have a little fog, maybe even up to Rainbow. So high pressure, this dome of warm air, that's coming our way, and it's also going to be tapping into the monsoon moisture. So not only is it going to be hot, but it's also going to be humid. All of these warnings are in effect for this heat. I'm going to be breaking down the warnings coming up in our next half hour, and I know there's a lot going on here, so I'm going to break it down for you day by day and zone by zone. So along the beach, Thursday and Friday, today and tomorrow, the bigger waves coming through five to 10 feet. Surf starts to lower on Saturday. Strong rip currents up and down the coastline. The biggest waves will be north of Encinitas. The heat, the hottest day is going to be tomorrow. And in fact, Saturday is trending a little less hot than it was looking. So that is good news. But the humidity is going to be higher. So ooh, it's going to be give or take. So the hottest day tomorrow, the most humid day Saturday, but that humidity will continue into next week. And just be cautious in the heat when you're walking your pets. Temperatures are going to be well above 190 in some areas. So think about the concrete and the asphalt. It's going to be very, very hot. So try and walk them on the grass and short brief walks would be a lot better for them. So the high surf continues through tomorrow, 90 degrees along our coastline. There is going to be a slight chance for maybe a few showers or thunderstorms starting on Saturday near the mountains, but there's going to be enough moisture Sunday and Monday and enough westerly movement in some of those storms that they may move into the coast or the valleys. Not likely, but I can't rule it out. 104 tomorrow inland, the hottest day, 98 degrees on Saturday, but more humid. That slight chance for a few showers or thunderstorms will continue into Tuesday in our mountains. 110 to 115 or so uh, through Saturday in our deserts. It's going to be really hot.